Here's the Redmi Note 11. I'm going to show you two ways how you can perform a factory reset. We're going to do a soft reset and a hard reset. Soft reset, you have to log in to the phone first, and a hard reset, you don't have to log in. We're just going to use the hard keys, okay? So the first way is a soft reset. Log into your phone, and then from here, you want to go ahead and go directly to settings. So let me go to my settings here. And then from here, you want to go ahead and you want to click on about phone. And then you want to scroll down a little bit until you see factory reset. All right, take note, backup and restore is up here as well. Okay, so we're going to tap on factory reset right there. Now take note of this, factory reset. Erase the following items. It's going to erase your accounts, your photos and videos, all your personal data, uh, even your SD card. Okay, so if you have anything important you want to save on your SD card, you can go ahead and eject the SD card. All right, and then if you want to proceed with the uh, factory reset, you can click down here where it says erase all data. Also take note, if you have a Gmail account that's synced to the email app on this phone, once you're done the factory reset and you start going through the setup process, it may ask for your Gmail as well as your password um, that was linked to this phone in order to complete the setup. So if you're selling your phone, right now you want to delete that Gmail account first and then do the factory reset, okay? Anyway, so from here, to do the factory reset, click on erase all data, tap on that, and then you can back up first, but I'm just going to click on factory reset right there. And then you get a countdown here. Wait till it counts down, then we can press next. One. Okay, and then you can go ahead and tap on next again. And now it's going to give you another countdown, okay? Once that 10 seconds is up on okay, click on okay, and it's going to perform the factory reset. It'll take about five minutes, okay? I'm going to cancel this because the next thing I'm going to do is a hard reset. Okay, so hard reset is simply using these keys and you don't have to log in, all right? So this is what we're going to do. First thing is we're going to turn off the phone, press and hold the power button. Now we're going to go ahead and power off, power off, power off. Now once the phone is completely off, next thing we want to do is we want to press and hold the uh, power button, okay? So press and hold the, uh, or I'm sorry, it's going to be, you're going to press and hold the power button and the volume up. You want to press and hold both buttons, both buttons at the same time. As soon as you hit the Mi logo, let go both buttons, okay? We'll do it together. Volume up. Power button, ready, set, go. Press and hold, keep on going, keep on holding until we see a me logo, then let go of both buttons. Still holding, it just vibrated. Where's that me logo, there it is. Let go of both buttons. And now, give it one moment here. Okay, so we're in this uh, recovery menu here. And what we wanna do is go down to where it says white data, okay? So you can move up and down using the volume up or down rockers. So we're gonna go down to white data and then we're going to tap on the power button, select it. Then we're going to go down again to wipe all data, select it. We're going to press the power button. Now we need to confirm. Okay, we're going to go down one and we're going to confirm right there. We're going to click right there. Progress bar, give us about five minutes. Oh, sorry, we got one more thing to do here. So from here, it says wipe data successfully. So now it defaults us, it highlights back to main menu, and that's what we want. So we're going to tap on the power button. And then it defaults to reboot, and we want to reboot. So tap on the power button, and then reboot to system, reboot to system, and then we're going to tap on the power button again. And now it's going to perform this factory reset, and this whole process is going to take about five minutes, so you need to be patient here. You're going to see the Mi logo, and then it's going to be like an all-black screen for a little bit, and then the Mi logo will appear again, so just be patient. Also, don't forget, if you guys had a Gmail account, a Google account, a Gmail email address that was synced to this phone, once we're done the factory reset, eventually it may ask you uh, for, that, um, for that Gmail address as well as a password in order to complete the setup, okay? You see our little progress bar down there moving. All right, we're just about done here, and voila, we just performed a factory reset, okay? Any questions, issues, comment below.